Hello everyone, welcome to BSP Solution. Today we are going to talk about the check-in notification in the performance management. So let's just discuss about the check-in notification. So when you configure the notification to send notification, sorry, when you configure the application to send the notification, when different roles create or delete check-ins, discussion topic in check-ins or notes for the discussion topics. So when an employer makes any of the ever changes, it sends notification to the performance manager. Okay. And when the performance manager make these changes, it sends notification to the respective employees. So, when an HR specialist makes these changes, it sends notification to the performance manager and the employee. Okay, so please remember, when a user deletes a check-in document or a discussion topic, the application does not send separate alert notification for any deleted notes within the check-in document or discussion topic. It sends a notification only once for the deleted discussion topic or check-in documents. Okay, let's see how we can perform this in the application. So, for that, we have to just go to the application. Okay, so here I log in as an HR specialist. So, you can configure notification for check-ins and requested feedback using Alert Composer. Okay, so we have to go to the navigator. And then we have to go to the tools. And from here, we have to go to the alert composer option. Here you can search for the uh, keywords like checking okay so these are check-in related alerts you can see here if let's just search for the feedback then here you can see the alerts related to the feedback okay so you can also select the edit option from this action icon and then you want to enable or disable these things. Right here you can see that this is enabled and you can add the templates here. You can see the run options and change the run option setup here. You can change the name and then change the description here okay so the, here on the edit event alert page you can see the available email templates sent to different roles okay and they are enabled by the defaults so here you can see the access level access level is extensible. Okay, so here it's going to be the different role as a part of the alert. Okay. Same way, if you want to go to in any of the check-in templates. Here. We just go to the edit. Here you can see that. Right? It's going to be the manager, employee, manager. And to manager, then HR has deleted a check-in. And to employee, HR has deleted a check-in. Then to manager, employee has a deleted a check-in. And to employee, manager has a deleted a check-in. So these are the template you can configure. Okay.
and here you can see the language the source language the name right and here you can write the code for the template okay it just close this and this is a preview option here okay what is the preview so this is the mail alert this is a worker list okay and we also send the html context so this is a translation editor this is a preview okay you can here see that you can add the template from here okay so these are the things you can do from the alert composer and for this you have you have to need the HRC access alert composer privilege to do this task. Okay. So, how we can configure notification from check-ins and requested feedback from the alert composer option, uh, you can understand from this video. So, I hope this topic is clear to you. So, thank you so much for watching the video.